crazy. Ever since cameras were invented, man has used them as a way to capture evidence of things they shouldn't, from creepy spectral orbs to blurry footage of Bigfoot. But what are some of the most odd, the strangest, the most peculiar? Today we'll explore them all, but beware, you're in for a scare. These are 20 weird things caught on camera. Number 20. Spotting someone in need. This drone made a chilling discovery after spotting this on a side of a mountain. As noted, drones are very useful at getting some great scenic shots of an area that most people can't see most of the time due to being on the ground or unable to reach a certain place to look over an area. In this first clip, a man named Babu and his friends were doing some hiking in India when the worst came to pass. Babu slipped and fell down the side of the mountain. The twist was that he lived and actually was holed up in a literal hole in the side of the cliff face. The problem was that while he was safe, he could not go down, he couldn't go up, and he needed to be rescued. Early attempts to get him had failed because of the specific place that he was in. Helicopters couldn't reach him, and they couldn't just send someone to climb up after him. The reason they knew where he was specifically was because they were able to launch drones to look and see where he was so a plan could be formed. But many attempts at getting him out had failed. It took an intervention from the National Disaster Response Force in order to finally rescue him, and by that point, he had been in that hole for 40 hours. Can you imagine being stuck in a hole for that amount of time, without any food or water or so much as room to wiggle around? Your body can tend to lock up if you're not getting proper movement, and obviously going almost two days without any resources was not good for him. While he was able to get free of his confinement, it was absolutely a rough situation, and the pictures that he took of his misadventure proved it. The drone became a key part of getting him down, and for that we should all be grateful. However, let this also be a lesson to all of you out there that climbing up rock walls can be dangerous even when you're doing it with friends. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Now it's time for the sweet topic. If cameras made it easy to capture evidence of anything and everything, drones made it ten times easier. And this drone made a chilling discovery after spotting this on a side of a mountain. Filmed in the Alps, it revealed something nobody knew was there, a peculiar but beautiful statue. What's chilling is that nobody knows who carved it or why, but given its location, it presumably has some kind of connection to the old religion devotions of Europe. Whoever carved it and whoever they were trying to celebrate, it's truly beautiful. Even if the fact we don't know what it's a carving of is kind of creepy. Why don't humans carve stuff like this anymore? As always, you can let me know your thoughts in the comments section down below by using the hashtag SweetTopic. Number 19. Moose Shedding Antlers Another thing that makes drones the perfect cameraman for certain people is that they can watch animals from afar and ensure that they catch rare moments without fearing spooking them by the sound of their very human approach. For example, right now, picture a moose. Because when you think about moose, you may often think of them as big creatures with massive antlers that can withstand the cold and take out cars if somebody was dumb enough to run into one. But what if I told you that during the winter season, moose will literally shake off their antlers? Would you believe me? Probably not. After all, it does sound kind of ridiculous. However, it's a very true statement and this drone footage proves it. As you can see, the moose is just doing its thing in a snowy valley, and then it begins to shake, and when it does, the antlers on its head snap off like twigs. Since when could they even do that? I mean, after all, they're strong enough to take down foes if something was to attack them, so how could they just straight up snap their antlers off with such ease? Well, it's because it's what they naturally do. You shouldn't forget those antlers are heavy, and so in snowy seasons they'll shed them since they're not needed as much, and then they'll regrow them when the springtime comes. The shedding process, also known as casting, is a normal event that occurs annually for many male moose and other antler species. Oh, and when I say the antlers are not needed, I don't mean that they're not needed for protection and whatnot. Rather, I'm referring to the fact that moose will use their antlers to attract a mate. 
and in the winter time, the mating season is over. You know, priorities and all that stuff. Number 18. UFO Footage Now, before you begin raging about whether UFOs are real or not, or whether a drone actually saw a UFO, I need to lay down some context here, because this is not going to go how you think. Now, you may recall that earlier in the year 2023 in the United States, the Pentagon had a hearing to highlight some of the potential UFO sightings that were actually known about by the government. This footage from the Middle East in 2022 was one of the pieces of footage that would be shown, and they do indeed highlight a UFO. Not an alien, perhaps, but a UFO. Because you have to remember that UFO actually stands for Unidentified Flying Object. And that's exactly what we have here. It doesn't always mean alien spacecraft. It can be an object of spherical nature that's flying through the air without any obvious means of propulsion, and this one has been caught on the drone's camera. This footage was shot in July of 2022 from an American MQ-9 Reaper drone. Now, while we don't really know what the sphere is that's flying through the sky, the government agents that showed it didn't think that it was alien technology or anything of that like. There were actually 650 events shown at the Pentagon briefing, and very few of them did they determine anything of note. But that means that there were things of note that couldn't be explained, so that's rather impressive. Now, look, I know that UFO stories are a very hard thing to talk about, because numerous people don't actually believe in them, or aliens, or anything of that like, and that is their right. But you can see this official footage from an official drone, and you can very easily tell that something is going on. Now, I don't really know what kind of something is going on, but it is something in the end. Number 17. Wind Turbine Solitude now, this next one is definitely a video that none of you were expecting, I can guarantee that. A drone near a school was doing a pass-by when, all of a sudden, it went by a wind turbine that was also near the school. And when it looked at the top, which was over 50 meters in the air, it spotted a man. Now, to be clear, this was not a man working on the turbine, as that technically wouldn't be all that odd. Instead, it was a man who was just sitting there. A Benedictine monk who works at a private Rhode Island school was just trying to have some solitude when the drone passed by and spotted him. Now at first, he, brother Joseph Byron, was fine with the drone looking at him, but then it just kept on disturbing his peace and as a result he became annoyed. After all, he had gone up there to really enjoy the view. Now I'm not joking about any of this. The man had been working at the school for a long time and when he wanted some peace and quiet, he would climb up the turbine and then go have a nice peaceful look out at the area. After all, nobody would have expected to find him up that high. After the drone footage would go viral, he was then contacted by past students who had recognized him. Now, on one hand, I can appreciate the man wanting some peace and quiet, picking a very unique spot to get some solitude. But on the other hand, that is still a pretty dangerous thing to go up to the top of a wind turbine just to get some alone time. Plus, I'm not exactly sure if it was even legal. Not to mention that might have inspired other people to do the same thing, and thus his solitude would now really be ruined. At least it was nice while it lasted. Number 16. Don't provoke the animals. Now I previously showed you what happens when a drone is able to catch an animal out in the wild, in their element, and it doesn't know that the drone is there. But now I'm going to show you a video where an animal's captured within its own element and it does know the drone is there, and it wasn't too happy about seeing it. This video would be captured by a person named Dane Hurst, a camera operator for the Australian Broadcasting Corporation, and back in 2021. He was trying to get some documentary footage about crocodiles for a special piece when things got, well, rather aggressive. They were going well enough. He was getting some decent footage up close, but the problem was that the crocodiles were being rather skittish about the drone. Considering it's not something that they would see every day, it wasn't exactly a surprise, but one crocodile then decided to stay relatively still, and Dane thought that this meant it wouldn't mind being filmed, but he was absolutely wrong. Because when the drone was in range of the crocodile, the animal leapt out of the water and snatched the drone within its jaws. Whoops! 
He first thought that he would never see that drone again, but the staff at the park actually found it washed up on the bank of the lagoon two weeks later. The drone was mostly intact and the footage was able to be extracted. However, let this be an ultimate lesson to you. While it is all right to film animals in the wild, you shouldn't get too close to them because you just never know how they're going to react or interact with what you present to them. Number 15. Move those trees. The video that you're seeing right now is one that went viral and it's not hard to see why. A drone from above was watching some trees that were in a forest when suddenly some of those trees begin to violently shake. However, it's only a few of the trees, as though they're being targeted by something. Given the violent nature that the trees were being pushed around, many had wondered if something like Bigfoot would be responsible. The video did certainly make it seem as though something odd was going on, but that's where the other same video came into play. Because someone recognized the location and then went to where the drone had caught the footage, and thanks to some keen investigation, they were able to find the original video from the drone, and it clearly showed that there was some human equipment that was cutting down those trees. The viral video had been edited in such a way to where the equipment could not be seen. So, say it with me, that's why you don't trust everything you see on the internet. Number 14. The Black-Eyed Girl Sadly, I am not going to dive into something realistic again just yet because earlier this year, a drone caught footage of what many feel is definitive proof of a local legend in the woods at Connacht Chase, especially since there was a killer that was once said to have taken the life of a seven-year-old girl and then buried her within those woods. Ever since then, there have been sightings of a black-eyed girl, and the drone footage that you're seeing now has been claimed to be further proof of those hauntings. Naturally, all kinds of ghost hunters and supernatural investigators have combed those woods, looking for more proof of the said black-eyed girl. And if you're curious, the reason that she allegedly has those black eyes isn't only because she's a ghost, but because during the time of her death, diphtheria was spreading throughout the UK like mad, and she may have well had it. The side effect of that disease is having your eyes go black. Whether this is actually proof of the supernatural is not really for anyone to say, but a lot of people were spooked when this footage came out, and I can tell you that for sure. Number 13. A Reverse Waterfall Finally, I'll get back to the true natural order of things and show you something a little unnatural. Now, this is not a supernatural thing, but instead, it is something that does not naturally occur unless the situation is just right. In Utah, back in January, drone footage caught a local waterfall flowing in reverse. But how does something like that happen? Obviously, it comes down to nature. Strong winds were ripping across the state, creating these intense updrafts along cliff faces that had caused the waterfall to spray backwards. In other words, the water from the falls flowed downward, but when the wind caught it and had such an updraft that it carried the water back up and over the cliff face. As you can see in this video, that is not something that happens just anywhere. There are major forces that are helping that water to go up and over where it had once come from. The drone operator even admitted that the drone had trouble staying in that area thanks to the high winds. Number 12. Rescue Mission Getting a bit more serious, I'll show you some footage from a rescue event from a drone that took part back in 2018. Thanks to that drone, an elderly man was able to survive a very scary incident. Publishing company owner Peter Pugh had been walking on Brancaster Beach one Saturday when he suddenly went missing after having been separated from his group while trying to take a shortcut home. Now obviously he never made it home, but instead got stuck in some nearby marshes and then could not get out. At first, no one really thought anything of his disappearance, but then when he didn't arrive home after 20 hours, people then went to look for the 75-year-old man. The only reason he was able to stay alive was because he knew that he could drink the local creek water that was within reach, and so he didn't panic. Thankfully, once the rescue operation began, 
A sergeant used a drone and was able to spot him within the marsh bed. It kept a lock on him while the sergeant spread the word and people were able to get to his location. Without the drone being the literal eye in the sky, the rescue team may have well taken much longer, and equally as important, it would have put the man at more risk of dying. Number 11. Kayaker and the Orca now here's a video that is likely to brighten your day. Over in New Zealand, a drone operator was trying to get some nice pictures when it stumbled upon a kayaker doing their thing in the water. As they hovered over it, they and the kayaker were shocked when an orca appeared out of the water and seemed to greet the boater. The kayaker then got out of their kayak and proceeded to swim and play with the orca. It is a very dangerous thing, however, that orca seemed to be in a very playful mood and didn't mind things one little bit. In fact, the orca was having such fun that when the person left to paddle away in their boat, the whale actually followed them. And then some other orcas came along and decided to have some fun with the kayak. Now truly, this is a once-in-a-lifetime moment caught on camera. Sure, we see whales interacting with humans at certain water parks, but those are usually trained creatures. These were wild whales, and things could have gone quite wrong in a hurry. Instead though, everything went right, and the results were truly beautiful. Number 10. The Tribes of Brazil at first, you may not understand what I'm talking about with that statement. I mean, after all, Brazil is a country, it has a government, and the people there are mostly civilized. The key word there is mostly, and no, I'm not talking about gangs, cartels, or corrupt politicians. I mean that in Brazil, or more specifically within the Amazon rainforest, are indigenous tribes that have been living in their traditional ways for untold numbers of years. They have no desire to have any kind of contact with the outside world, and it's actually possible that they don't even know about modern society in general. As such, the people of Brazil have to be quite careful with how they attempt to watch these people, and that means using things like drones to get aerial footage of them. With this footage, they can prove that these tribes do still exist, and as a benefit to that, they can try to protect them from those who encroach upon their territory. Number 9. Kangaroo Punch for those of you who are fans of All Elite Wrestling, you may know that one of the most devastating moves that's been born as of late is the dreadful kangaroo kick. But when it comes to actual kangaroos, they don't mind punching their way out of a situation. And yes, this is indeed another situation where a drone decided to get too close to an animal. I mean, seriously, when will these operators learn? Yet, in this case, a drone was doing some aerial recon on a group of kangaroos, and it was going quite well. It did spook them just a little bit, but it was still a good distance away from them. Then, that drone got close to a mother and her joey, and as a result, the mother took some action, hopped over to it, and then pummeled the drone, knocking it to the ground. And here is your winner by KO, the mother kangaroo. Number 8. Tiger Strike Sadly, the next piece of footage is not quite as beautiful as it is portrayed. This video went viral when it showed off the beauty of tigers in action, as a group of them were being encouraged to chase a drone through the compound that they were in, and as a result, some beautiful shots would be taken. The tigers eventually did get the drone and took it down, before leaving it be after they realized that it was not a bird or some kind of other flying food. So, where's the dark side in all of this? It would later be revealed that the footage was taken at a tiger farm in China. That's a place where they raise tigers in order to get money from tourists, and then they sell their parts to interested parties later on. That's not animal conservation by any means. That's actually a breeding grounds for slaughter in a way that's not right, and many people have called out the video after they found out the facts. Number 7. Bicycle Graveyard Graveyards are always a place that people find weird or spooky depending on the time, place, and circumstance. A different drone in a different part of China was able to get footage of what could only be called a bicycle graveyard. The bikes in the shot were ones that were confiscated by the Chinese government, and then they were dumped there. And for the record, there are tens of thousands of bikes within this one singular place. Now believe it or not, you do actually need a license to ride a bike in the country, and they'll take the ones that are not licensed. 
Plus, there were already plenty of bikes that had been abandoned due to people not really being enthralled with cycling anymore. When you look at the graveyard from above, you would never guess those were tens of thousands of bikes, and yet there they all are. Number 6. Plainside now, I'm not going to deny that this next one is the aftermath of a near-fatal situation. Picture this. You're on a plane and you're about to land at your destination. Everything's gone smoothly up to that point. But right when you land, the plane veers off the runway and it happens to be heading for a cliff that's nearby. That's exactly what took place with this airplane. And it's honestly a miracle that it didn't crash into the waters below. Naturally, those who were inside the plane were panicked, but thankfully they all got out alive and without a whole lot of injury. It just goes to show you that while plane travel is the safest form of travel, especially with modern advances, it doesn't mean that they're immune from disasters taking place. And they can happen at any moment. I'm not saying it's going to happen on your next flight, but the possibility is always there. Number 5. Your Close-Up Shot It's not really surprising that certain people at weddings would want a truly lasting memory outside of beautiful pictures and a nice after party. For this couple, they decided it would be a fantastic idea to hire a photographer to get a drone to get some unique footage of them together after their big moment. And surely enough, at the start, things are going well, and the guy is getting some nice dramatic footage. But then he begins to lose control of the drone and it goes wild, crashing right into the couple. Yes, this is why drone technology isn't everywhere just yet. While they are beautiful machines and can do a lot of good as you've seen, they can also be quite hard to control. So the next time you want a great video or a picture at your wedding, just go for the regular old camera. Number 4 monkeying around. After everything you've seen, you would think that these drone operators would realize that you don't want to get too close to an animal unless you want something to go wrong. And surely enough, here we are showcasing yet another one. In this clip, a drone decides to get close to a chimpanzee enclosure, except that the monkeys see the drone coming, and when monkey see, monkey do something bad to the drone. It whacked it with a stick and sent it hurtling to the ground. Then the chimpanzee got the drone off the ground and gave it some rather unique close-up shots. I'm sure that next time that drone operator will simply look at the monkeys from afar. Number 3. Crop Circle Now here we go again with aliens and the mystery of crop circles. Thanks to this drone footage, we can tell that this field of wheat was carved up to display a rather unique symbol, but what the point of the symbol is is actually unclear. The farmer whose field was ravaged by it was not exactly happy that it had cost him a pretty penny in product, but don't worry, I'm not going to say that it was done by aliens or certain beings from beyond. We know that humans are perfectly capable of doing something like this for one reason or another. Now, I don't know exactly why this was done, or how it was done, or why this particular symbol, but they did have some impeccable precision, no matter what had been used or who had done it. Number 2. Crop Circle Again Now, in Italy, someone had decided that they wanted to make a crop circle that depicted Kim Jong-un. No, I'm not joking. And here it is in all of its glory. The crazy thing is the guy who had made it was an artist who had just used his tractor to make the portrait, and it wasn't the first world leader he had done that with in the past. I'm not really sure how someone wakes up one day and simply decides to make a crop circle of an infamous world leader, but he did, and you have to admit it's a good likeness. And if you can't tell, those are missiles above his head. Number 1. Waves of Fish when you first look at this footage, you may think that you're seeing something well beyond what can be on the Earth. You know, something rather science fiction. But instead, what you're seeing is a massive school of fish that are traveling together through the water, and they were all picked up by drone. The word mesmerizing comes to mind when you look at the footage, because as you can see, the fish beautifully weave in and out of one another to create whatever it is that they want. 
It's unclear why they were so fixed in that area, but that's honestly not important because of how beautiful that it all looks. Now, we have seen these kind of swarms in the past with birds and bugs, and it's nice to see that fish can get in on the action as well. That's all from the realm of drones and the various things that they've caught on their cameras while viewing the world. Were you surprised by some of the things that they spotted? And which ones were you glad that they got to see? Perhaps you know of another time when drones were able to capture something big on camera. You should be sure to let me know all about it in the comments section down below. Check out all the other cool things that are showing up on the screen, and I will see you next time.